Okay, so on this problem it says how much pure acid must be mixed with um, five percent with two hundred milliliters of five percent acid to get twenty five percent acid. Well, this is a mixture problem, and so you're always mixing. When you do a mixture problem, I like to draw boxes to represent what I'm mixing together. You can think of them as beakers or something as you're mixing these together, or bottles or whatever. And I think about what I'm mixing together. Well, I'm mixing pure acid. So my percent acid in this is 100%. I'm mixing it with 5% at that with 5% acid. And my goal is to get 25% acid. So I'm taking 100% acid. I'm mixing it with 5% acid, trying to get 25% acid. Well, I want to know, I got to know how much I have of each of these. So it says, how much pure acid? So that's the question. So I don't know the amount of pure acid. So I'm going to let that be X. It tells me exactly how much of the 5%. That's going to be 200. And if I'm mixing these two together, that means that the total I have, I'm left with has to be 200 plus X, right? That 25% solution must be 200 plus X. Now that I've set up my chart, the way to solve it is just to multiply down. 100% times x, well, we turn the 100% just to a decimal, which is 1. So that gets me x plus 5%, which is 0 0.05, times 200, equals 25%, so 0.25, times 200 plus x. Now let's just solve an equation. So that's going to give you x plus, well, 5% of 200 is just 10, equals 25% of 200, which is 50, and then plus 25x. I need to solve this, so I'm going to subtract 0.25x from both sides. And I'm going to subtract 10. I'm just doing two steps in one here. So that's going to give me 0.75x. Got rid of that. Equals 50 minus 10, which is 40. And I got rid of that. So you get 0.75x equals 40. So you divide both sides by 0.75x or 0.75 I mean. And so now all you have to do is determine what is 40 divided by 0.75 and that's going to equal um, 160 over 3 or maybe what you have on your calculator which would be 53.3 repeating milliliters. So the amount of pure acid you need to add to that 200 milliliters of 5% acid is 53.3 milliliters, three repeating milliliters. And you should leave your answer exact unless it asks you to round.